here at the Sarco Discovery Center for the copper mine here just south of Tucson. Looking forward to this tour, have been for quite a while. So it's going to be an exciting little adventure here. So come and join me. Let's see what this tour is all about. So um, my name is Roxanne. I've been here for just about six weeks now, so I know most of my script, but I don't have it all memorized. Mm -hmm. So, so I do, I do refer to it often. So um, my husband and I moved here just about five years ago from Southern California. We live in Green Valley. Two o'clock in the afternoon. So over here, this um, this photograph or this little video here will show you a picture of our. Gonna board the bus and take a tour of this big old copper mine. Uh, hell in a handbasket. So I think I told somebody I gave somebody bad information. So our haul trucks cost between five and six million dollars. Some of the items that have been used. So, and then this little solar. So, this road is part of the San Javier Indian Reservation. The dirt up there so that we can just keep dirt or keep the dust at a, at a minimum um, right here.
trucks have right away all the time. So those two containers on the right there, those white ones, they hold water for our water trucks to spray the roads down to keep the dust down. And this is going to ask for special permission to enter the mine. So we reclaim about 80% of our water and then the rest comes from the, the Arizona waterfront here locally. Trucks in there. Oh, there's one there being loaded. Well, the lid gets removed and then and then they load it with copper concentrate and they'll put the lid back on. Care of the copper concentrate before it goes on that conveyor belt. And this container here is a middling thickener before it goes to the vacuum filtering building. So that will get pulled back down and go through the process all over again. Um, off of the haul trucks into that final thick, um, oh, I can't talk today, into that, into that crusher. And then they go up that conveyor belt. And then they'll go from that conveyor belt into the mill. So those, and they'll go down where they're going to do blasting and they will um, fill fill the holes that they, that they drew. We have permission to It's kind of fun to see him setting up for a blast. Here at the uh, viewing point, see all the mine in action. Really a cool tour. Our um, haul trucks are really busy over here collecting rocks. They must have had a blast uh, yesterday. to the bottom and to the center and we get about 12 to 15 percent copper out of that. You can see the kind of a little green tinge ah. to that. That's the that's the copper. Ah. Yeah, I can do it with anodes. Exactly. Uh, loaded on the truck. 
It sounds much terrible. And there we go. About the same reason. And copper is known for its flexibility, conformity, its thermal and electrical conductivity, and corrosion resistance makes it an ideal. property now headed towards the discovery center thank you all so much for coming along on this tour i hope you enjoyed it hope you got to learn something and if i didn't answer your questions and you want to ask me again i will do my best to answer them and liz thank you so much for a great ride you're welcome